Hello guys, welcome back to Ray House Gaming. In today's videos, as I said, I will talk about the uh, the breakthrough of the new go heroes. I will show you a table. Um, what do you need to prepare about the new go heroes? Okay, and then I will show you some informations in my Chinese account also. It's not Taiwan server. Okay, it's a China China Chinese server. I I have been playing a small account, a new account in China server. Also, okay, they are having the latest latest features of this game so i will show you some information it's about the new go heroes also i know it's a bit too early for you guys but since i talked about all the new go heroes already so i just want to finish whatever we have about the new go heroes okay then we finish the topic of new go heroes at the moment all right so before i show you the net the another account if you know this i already changed my huang my xiao chao to huang yue yun and in my previous videos, when I did changes to my team, I forgot that I can actually tally my revive my Xiao Chao and then tally her to Huang Yuyun. I totally forgot about that, and then I didn't do the changes. Okay, and then one of my subscribers remind me, so I already did the changes. I have changed her to uh Xiao Chao to Huang Yuyun. So right now we already hit two hundred million. So far so good. And to be honest, this this. CP is still a bit too low for my server. Okay, and then uh after all these changes, the main thing that I noticed is my team is becoming more tanky. Uh the main thing the main reason is because of Wyoming of course. Uh, but in terms of damage wise it does not increase a lot to be honest because my Zhangfei is still a bit weak. So that in terms of damage, it does not increase a lot, but in terms of the durability of the team, it is in, it is increased a lot in PV, PvP and also in PvE, especially in the PvE, okay, when I do in the story instance, it the changes is quite, you know, it's quite obvious. So, um, anyway, we need to keep fighting, okay, this is a long term game, so don't give up, just keep going. So right now, let me just go to the table. I will show the table first. This is the table um about the materials that you need to collect to break to your new go heroes. Nothing special about all these liquor break to peel all these things. Okay, the main thing is the required number of heroes. As you guys know that for our divine and legendary heroes, when we break two from talent one to talent four, we don't need same hero to break through but for the new goal heroes from talent one we need the same new goal heroes to break through okay so and then in my taiwan server we have the all the new goal new goal heroes they are having talent one to five okay as you can see in the in this table we, we have talent one to talent five but i know this one one thing is that in chine chinese server they are having plus six also. Okay, I just noti noticed that recently. Um, so um, this table is not the latest, and I can't find the information about the brick two plus six also. So when I find the information, I will do an update on this table and on the tail, and also then I will share with you guys. Okay. So for now, it's only from one to five. So from one to five, you will need a total of eleven new go heroes plus your your the hero that you are using so you will need 12 new gold heroes to reach plus five okay so it's not cheap and then one new gold heroes is very hard to get you either get it by the by the by by your free draw or by your time by the time or by your luck or by your money okay the easiest way is by your money of course so it's not cheap and then if you want to use the new gold heroes you need to be at least plus three because before plus three they are quite weak and they will not be very useful to your team. So in order to use one new go heroes, you will need four plus one. So it's five new go heroes that you will need to obtain. Okay, you will need to get from the event. So it is not cheap. Just think about it before you use this new go heroes when you get one. Okay, and then you still need to keep two to break to your divine heroes also. Okay, so this is the table. And then let's go to the game. Um, this is uh as I said, this is a new account that I have been playing in Chinese server. Okay, the main thing I'm I just doing the events and I just want to get some informations from their server. 
So all these go heroes I talked about it already, and they are having TLN number six. I will I will, I will do an video about this update, okay? But not in these videos. And then what I want to share with you is that in Ty in my Taiwan server, we can get the new go heroes from the go heroes event draw. I show you guys the event already, okay? I'm not sure about the earlier server in Taiwan versions. I mean in my Taiwan server That's the only way that we can get these new go heroes, but in Chinese versions There is a event there is an event called Cross server legend boss event. Okay, it is our favorite event But this one is cross server cross server and then you are not fighting the 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 boss like Sima Yi Li Bu or uh, not Li Bu Sima Yi Zhao Yun or whatever. You are fighting these new go heroes, okay? And then the the way that you play this legend boss is different from what we are playing right now, okay? The crossover legend boss is different. Um, this one I will I will talk I I will share with you guys before they launch it in the English versions. Don't worry about that. So in this Legend Boss event, you can get the new gold heroes shot in the oceans after the events. Then you can buy it from the oceans, okay? And you cannot buy it with your ingots. You still you still need to buy it with this thing. And then this thing you need to top up by money to get it. Okay? So it's still not totally free actually. So um this you need to top up to to get this game credit. This is a new game credit that they have in Chinese account. We don't have it in, in Taiwan server also. Okay, so you need to build with these things. And then um you may want to ask me how do you get this 165 credit? Do you top up? Well my answer is I did not top up. Okay, I only top up one dollar and then right now I'm VIP one. I only top up one dollar because um I can't actually top up anymore, okay, because I don't have the accounts and uh, my, my WeChat, the Embao function is already locked down. So I don't have any money to top up, okay, so I didn't top up for this one. This one is, I got it from the Divine Ends, okay, so when your legend, when your legend got this um, Go Heroes shot in the, in the oceans, then you will get the divine end with this game credit, okay? Then you can beat beat the you can beat the new go hero shot in future with this game credit also. So it's not total hundred percent free, and it, it is is not totally hundred percent that you need to spend money to get it, okay? But if you want to save it by divine ends, it will take use a very very long time. All right. Okay, so far this is the ways that I know how to get a new Go Heroes Legend Cross Server Legend Boss event and then the Go Heroes event draw. The easiest way is the Go Hero event store. And then of course one more thing is the K events, which is um I'm not sure how we need to wait for how many months to have the new Go Heroes in the K events. Okay, so that is a very long time story. But so far the easiest way is by Legend Boss event and then by the uh new go new go heroes event drop all right so um i think that's all about these videos you know um there are a lot a lot of features that i noticed in this chinese account that i will which i will talk about it in a you know in one i think is the right time to talk because it's a bit too early for us there are some features which you need to know first before they launch okay because when they launch if you are not prepared you will you know you will you will have a lot of headache okay for that i will share with you so don't worry but not at the moment and i will i will i'm thinking i will share with you before end of this month okay so don't worry about that and that's all about these videos and i'm thinking in the next two days i will do a uh, videos about samurai era okay um it's a pretty new game to me um i have done two videos already but it's still a new game to me. I'm still trying to understand about the game, okay? But I will make a video in these two days. And um, it, it's a, it has been a busy week this week for me. So I will try to do um, three, three, two more videos. Two more videos in this week, okay? So thank you guys for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.